Hi guys, today we are going to see how you can get the email addresses of LinkedIn profiles. Let's say you want to collect the email IDs of people on LinkedIn so that you can send them emails to promote or sell your products. You can do that by watching this video. So after watching this video, you will be able to find and get any person's contact details from their LinkedIn profiles, which includes the email address and mobile number. Next, we will also see how you can get the LinkedIn profile data of a specific group of people like a list of CEOs, executives of a specific industry or based on a job role which contains the email IDs and you can export these LinkedIn profile data to use it on any Excel sheet like this. Next, we will also see how you can send emails to these people. Okay, now we are going to see everything step by step. I'm Brian from Website Learners and let's get started. Now to get the email addresses from LinkedIn profiles, we are going to do five steps. The first step is to create an account on SalesQL. Now this is the tool which will help you get the email addresses of LinkedIn profiles. So to use this tool, we need to create an account. Now to create your account on SalesQL, just click the link below this video and it'll take you to this page. Now click start now. And here you can use any of these options to create your account. I'm going to sign up with my LinkedIn account. So let's click on it. Now your LinkedIn account is needed to get the email IDs of the LinkedIn profiles. So if you don't have a LinkedIn account, you can click join now to create your account. Here enter your LinkedIn account email ID or mobile number, then enter your password and click sign in. Here click allow. Now SalesQL will ask these details to create your account. So let's fill up these details. And once you're done, just click continue. Your SalesQL account will be successfully created. Okay. Once you have created your SalesQL account, now let's go to step 2 which is to install the SalesQL browser extension. This extension will help you get the email IDs from LinkedIn profiles. You can install these extensions on these browsers. I'm going to install it on Chrome. And here you can see that we need to manually install this extension. So let's click manual installation and click download now. An extension will be downloaded to your computer. Now to install this extension, we need to extract the zip file. So let's open the downloads folder. Now right click on the extension file, then select extract all and click extract. Once you have extracted the zip file, next we need to install this extension on our browser. So let's click on this extension icon and click manage extensions. Now enable the developer mode and you will get this option to import the downloaded extension. So let's click load unpack. Now select the sales SQL extension folder. Then click select folder. And you can see that we have successfully installed the sales SQL extension. Now if we go here, you can see that we have got the sales SQL extension. Now to make this easy to access, just click on the spin icon and it will be added here. Okay. Once you have installed the sales SQL extension, now let's go to the third step which is to connect sales SQL with LinkedIn. Now to do that, let's click my dashboard, then click on sales SQL extension. Now click open LinkedIn and it will take you to the LinkedIn website. Then it will ask you to connect your LinkedIn account with your sales SQL account. So let's click continue. Then your LinkedIn and sales SQL accounts will be connected. Once you have connected sales SQL with LinkedIn, we can now go to the next step which is to collect the email addresses of the LinkedIn profiles you want. So let's go to search. Now search for the person whom you want to get the email address. and you will get the person's LinkedIn profile. Now click their profile and if we click contact info, you can see that the person's email address is not visible here. So let's close this. Now to view the email, we need to connect them on LinkedIn. But if you want the email without connecting with them, just click the sales SQL extension and you can see that we have got the person's profile here. Now if we click on the plus icon, you can see that we have successfully got the email address of the person from their LinkedIn profile. Now if we scroll down, you can see that we have got more information about this person. So in the same way, you can get the email address of any LinkedIn profile you want. Okay, now you know how you can get a single person's email ID from their LinkedIn profile. Now instead of getting the email IDs one by one, let's say you want to get the email IDs of a lot of people from a similar industry or role. So how can you do that? 
So now let's go to the final step, which is to get the email addresses of multiple people at once. So to do that, let's go to search. Now let's say searching for CEOs or entrepreneurs. You can enter that here and you will get these results. As you can see, we have job posts related to our search. Now if you want to find only the people, you can select this people filter. And you can see the results. If you want to reach more specific people, click all filters. Now you can select the people based on their location and the previous services they provide. You can also use these filters to find profiles. Okay, once you have selected the filters, click show results. And you can see that we have got the people based on our filters. Now to find these people's email IDs, let's click on the sales SQL extension. And as you can see, we have got their LinkedIn profiles here. To get their email IDs, first we need to select the folder where we want to collect the emails. So let's click here. Then click new folder. Here enter the folder name. And click create and select. Next, we need to select the profiles to get their email IDs. So select the profiles. Click add. And the email IDs will be automatically added to the folder we created. Now if we go to the sales SQL account. And refresh the page. You can see that we have got a new email list folder. So let's open it. And you can see that we have got the profiles we selected and you can also see their email addresses. Now we have seen how to get emails from particular profiles. But what if you want to get all the email addresses at once? To get the emails of all the LinkedIn profiles in the search results, just click start here. And it will ask you to enter the starting and the ending page of the LinkedIn search results. So to find the ending page number, just scroll down. And you can see that we have got the search results for two pages. So let's enter 2 for the ending page number. And once you're done, like we did before, we need to select a folder. So let's click here. And click new folder. Give a name for the folder. Then click create. And finally, click continue. Once it's done, let's go back to our sales SQL account. And click refresh. You can see that we have got all the profiles and the email addresses. So now we have successfully got multiple email addresses from the LinkedIn profiles at once. Okay, next if we look at the phone number column, you can see that the phone numbers are not showing. Now if you click on mobile number, sales queue will, will ask you to upgrade to a paid plan. Also, if you try to export the data and click export here, Again, it will ask you to upgrade your plan. So if you want to export these LinkedIn profile data, including the email IDs and phone numbers, you need to get the paid plan from sales SQL. So to get the paid plan, let's click see plans. Now if we look at the paid plans, here you can see the number of profiles you can collect for every 6 months. Using a paid plan, you can get their personal and business email IDs. Also, you can get their mobile numbers. And finally, you will be able to export the LinkedIn profile data. Okay. Now you can select the plan based on your need. I am going to choose this plan. So let's click choose plan. Now fill up your billing details. And once you are done, click continue to payment. Now here enter your payment details. Click subscribe. And you can see that we have successfully purchased the plan we want. Now if we go to our list. You can see that we have got a lot more details about the people. Now if we click on a profile, you can see that we have successfully got the person's mobile number. Okay. Now to export these data, all you need to do is just click export. And our export file will be generated. Now just click download. And the file will be downloaded to your computer. Now if we click on it. You can see that we have got the list of LinkedIn profile data. And as you can see, we have got the email IDs and mobile numbers as well. Okay, now you know how you can get multiple email IDs. Once you have got the email IDs, 
Next, how will you use these email IDs to sell your products or services? So next, let's see how you can send emails to your LinkedIn email list. Now to send emails to your list, we are going to use a tool called GetResponse. This is the tool which will help you send emails to your list. Now we are going to create an account on GetResponse. To do that, just click the link below this video and it will take you to this page. Now fill up these details and click create account. Here, enter these details and click next step. And here, choose what you want to do. So I'm going to choose sending emails. Click next step and it will take you to this page. Now you need to add the email list which we have downloaded. To add that, click add contacts. Now select this option to upload the email list and then drag and drop the email list here. Now enable this option. Click next. And as you can see, the email list has been added here. And here we have different columns with some details. So now you can assign the names or the columns you want. For example, these fields represent the company name. So just click here and select the company name. Same way, do it for the required columns. Once it's done, enable this and click import. As you can see, our email list has been added here. Once you have added the contacts, click here to go back. You can start sending your first email to the email list. Just click create newsletter. Here, select how you want to create the email. You can do it by using an AI email generator or you can do it by yourself. I'm going to click myself. And here you can give a name for your email. This is for your reference and it won't be visible for anyone. Then here, you can give a subject line to your email. You can give a catchy headline so that you can stand out from other emails. And there will be higher chances that your contacts can open your email. Now click here. And select to whom you want to send the email. Here you can see the email list we uploaded. So select it. And click add. Now let's design the email content. Go to design message and select the blank template and select the empty template from here. Now if you want to add a logo, just click here and go to add image. Here drag and drop the logo from your PC and the logo will be added to your email design. And here you can add your email content. To add it, click here. Go to back to layouts. Now drag the text block and drop it over here. And write your email content. Now to build a connection with people, you can add their name in the email. To do that, click here. Select the first name. And this will automatically take you to the first name from the contact list. Okay, once you complete the contact, paste your email content and click next. And here you can select when you want to send this email. You can either send it immediately by clicking here or you can schedule it for later. You can just click here. Select the time and the date on when you want the email to be sent. And click schedule. And the email will be sent at the scheduled time. Now if they go to the inbox, you can see that this person has received an email. So this is how you can send emails to your LinkedIn email list. So that's it guys. This is how you can get email addresses of LinkedIn profiles and send emails to them. Once you have sent the email, now let's say people are checking your emails, but they're not purchasing your products or services. So how and where will you make the actual sales? Do you know what content you must write in your email to sell your products? Or do you have a website where you can send people and they can purchase your products or services? So to learn these things, you can take our sales funnel course where we will show you how you can build a strong relationship with your audience, how to set up automated emails to send follow-up emails to your customers and increase your sales. So just click the link here to learn from our sales funnel course. Also, make sure you click the subscribe button to see more videos from us. So thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.